I am the rocket man they talk about. I jump from star to star, I walk it out. Hey guys, should be 2142 here with Battlefield 2142 on the PC, some Camp Gibraltar Conquest. And after playing about four or five rounds on different servers, different maps, different game styles, whether that be Titan Conquest, etc., I think I am done with 2142 because you'll see that this round, there is just so much cheese, so much spam. So out of uh, all the rounds I played, this is definitely the worst one. And I just want to give you a taste of what this game has become. Now there may be one server out there out of the 20 or 25 that I found out of the whole world for this game. That's what I found. So that's uh, pretty unfortunate right there to get uh, tri triple killed by a uh, grenade. Getting revived does not cost me a death. There's this RXD C4 just waiting on the ground. There is our walker. One of the most awesome vehicles in this game. Definitely got me excited when I saw some... Uh, trailer gameplay way back when so uh, a lot of people think oh Star Wars that's just 2142 and our walker gets destroyed which kicks this all off I'm trying to get behind this rock here to heal up my teammate pushes me out so I'm running for my life teammates are getting blown up in the air it's just really really bad news once again I think I'm done with this game I just uh, I don't know guys it's a it's a great game but from the glory days of when this game was released and probably a year after with all the competition with friends and fun all that good stuff it has become so tainted with spam and cheesy tactics and people just don't seem to cherish what it used to be because they'll just run up to you throw down an RxD pack which is C4 once again and just blow it up so it's such as that Revive my teammate, that does not cost him a death, and he just throws another one over the rock and kills it both. So, uh, it's just, it was not fun. And I do not want to play more. Shibby, why wouldn't you want to play more? Because that will ruin and taint my memories of the game when I, I remembered it to be so good, my favorite Battlefield of all time, which it still is right now. I mean, Battlefield 3 is looking excellent. Absolutely excellent. So, uh, get the question. Yes, I will be picking up, so don't worry. My squad leader then gets taken out and it is important to revive him because he is the guy that the squad can spawn on. And this is not like Bad Company 2 where you can spawn on anyone in your squad. He does die again, I do revive him again. That is pretty common in this game because once again it does not add another death. It continues his first life from when he spawned and then of course I get C4 spam packed again. And that is just unfortunate. I then I'm going to change to the sniper class, hopefully to change it up a little bit. It's uh, unfortunate that it has come to that where <laughs> I can't really play much more medic than I can. And uh, later in the round I do switch back to medic, so don't worry about that. And one thing that I have noticed is this gun, this unlocked sniper rifle, is pretty bad because it does not one-shot with body shots like Bad Company 2 would at that range with magnum ammo. You will notice my teammate, C4 packing himself, up over the fence there trying to get onto the crane tower area, throwing down some claymore mines which go off when an enemy walks in front of them. Claymores are a decent way to protect yourself, especially on Titan corridors, but I do consider them a little cheesy because you don't have to detonate them or do anything. They're pretty much set it and forget it, and when they go off, it's typically a kill. I did not suicide there, That once again, that is more... C4 spam packing over whatever little barrier was on my left side or else he was up on the crane perhaps but I do have two teammates up there and they are uh, jumping down you can see the UAV flying in the air more Lewis this guy is in our spawn just blowing up guys as they uh, right away I mean he's dead just uh, I don't know this is not how I remember this game at all and out of the 20 or 25 servers that I could find that actually had people playing, once again, the keyword actually had people playing. There probably are more servers, but they were empty. Therefore, do not count. So if you check the minimap here, top right, we're all pretty much camped in. There is a walker basically sitting right there.
Going to town on everyone. I'm going to try and sneak here on the left side. See if I can take a little breather. But if you look around, walker, enemies everywhere. I thought that was a headshot, but I guess not. I do pull off a frag grenade kill here, but then all the frags, walker. Everything just goes to hell, and I just get owned. So there was really nothing I could do. My friend Led does end up joining, but regardless of our efforts together, our teamwork tactics does not work out. I'm debating whether to use the stock sniper there, but whatever. I will continue with the quote unquote advanced sniper rifle, derp derp derp, because it can zoom and all that good stuff. I I don't know. Taking out a sentry drone there, it's not quite as powerful as a uh, Team Fortress 2 sentry. I would put it on par with uh, a mini sentry on Team Fortress 2 where it doesn't do much damage but it is annoying and can kill if you're not paying attention. A few uh, bad sniper shots by me and it felt like the hit reg in this game was really poor. I was using the Voss earlier on a different server and uh, I think I did try it on this server as well. It just felt like it wasn't hitting what I was aiming at regardless of the spread which is a little bit different. Taking out this guy in the ground defense turret. Little headshot there and then I'm going to try and take out his drone. Think about C4 packing it. Not necessary. When a drone starts spinning like that it has died. But Shibe, is there someone to blame for this game starting to decline or already has declined? In my opinion I think so. I think a few people are at fault whether that be DICE or EA slacking on any patches or support. The latest patch was 1.51 hitting the stairs there. I was really unfortunate that my teammate there gets taken out. But yes, anyways, I think DICE could have done a better job at continuing to support this game, such as making it available on Steam. I think a Steam release for this game at a good price would have revived a lot of the community. It would obviously have more servers than available because there would be more interest in a larger player base. And uh, as you see there, basically the farthest pushed up on my team with my squad. Pretty sad, I did spawn on my squad leader there because he is the one in green. Thank you for watching guys. Part 2 coming soon, so subscribe for more as always and I'll see you next time.